What's going on, everybody? David Braley here. I'm a professional singer with more than 20 years of experience performing on stages all over the world. And I am watching for the very first time a blind reaction to BTS Love Is Not Over from their epilogue concert out in Japan. And here we go. We're going to do another one. Let's check out what this BTS thing has. I already like it. It's nice, mellow. Mm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm. Yes. Yes. Yeah, this is one of those beginnings. Like, um, I think I said in the last one, it's very similar. These these guys are very similar to like in the '90s when we had all the boy bands and everything. And right now, this is your kind of your typical boy band or, or I guess, K-pop entrance of just something very it's a bit windy it's a bit um it's light it's very floating a lot of air not, not a lot of air not in a bad way but you know what i mean like that stylized with with just a little touch of extra air mm. See, this is another one of those things where I, I love it when I watch these groups uh, listen to what they're singing. Uh, I don't know Korean, but there are the words right underneath that I'm kind of following along as we go. And um, man, they, they're singing it. I knew it was a love song, but they're, they're, they, they're given the emotion. They're saying, you know, love is so painful. And... You got really, really like. They've just got really great musicality with this. You know, they really know how to, how to, boost up something. You know, in the chords, you just kind of bring. Ring. Got a little bit on the, the, the drums, a bit of hi-hat, and a little bit just kind of just laying the beat. And their musicality, their, his, his use, his flow, his, uh, his, his, the words, the language that he's using, um, it just really, it's showcased so well. So well, they really know how to showcase themselves and they know how to, uh, their songwriters, uh, they know how to write songs that, um, that show off their their strengths, which are which is which is hard to do when you have somebody else writing your songs. You know, it's really good. Mm. Yeah, they're listening to what they're saying. They're listening to what they're saying. And I think they, they, they're doing it too because the audience is probably eating it up. Like that. 
all the levels they're using, you know, a big, big, big dramatic build up and then pulls it back and it's back into the chorus. Nice. I like the set though. Look at that. Look at that set. Oh, I missed it. <laughs> It is not over. It is not over. Man, they're really great. I, I mean, seriously, it's not just, it's more than, it's more than the music. It's, I mean, the music is fantastic. I mean, look at that stage, that, that set. Look at their, I mean, they're following clearly their entire um, marketability, you know, they're, they're just, see them do anything you know from commercials which i i'm sure they already do again out of the out of the loop commercials you could see them on tv you could see them performing at good morning america as well as big arena tours i mean these guys are pretty much your uh everybody loves them group which i think is pretty neat anyway that's it from me what a great tune really really well done and uh I hope you guys enjoyed it too. Thanks a lot. See you soon.